Hi, Julia and Natalie. How are you? Oh, good. How are you? How are you? Very well. I thought you were both exceptional in this film. I had all the feels, even the tears. Oh. So <laughs> for both of you, what did you like best about working with each other? Oh, that's oh my I, loved, I really loved everything. I know. Everything. We got to room together. Uh, yeah. We, we shared this little house and like it was so nice. We would wake up. I got to the point where I was sleeping with her dog every night. Like we just really became a like little that. family. Yeah, I did like that. And and you know, at night we would go over the lines and and try to figure out if there was anything that didn't make sense because of something we improvised earlier. And so it was just nice. We were kind of in a little bubble um, because we had to be. With yeah, we were like married. Yeah, we were like married <laughs> and working together. And guess what? We're great married we people. Are really good at it. <laughs> yeah, we just had a family. Done. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so did you two know each other beforehand? Because you had worked with a lot of the same people. Yes, we did know each other, but we hadn't worked together in like on, on film or TV. We did like a, a charity benefit show, a sketch show like in 2009 uh, and had known each other since then. I had seen each other and hung out. And like I came to see Jillian when and she was at SNL and like we've just followed each other's careers and lives, but had never had the opportunity to actually work together. So I was very, very thrilled when Jillian called me and asked me if I wanted to do this with her. Nobody better. Yeah. I love it. So tell me about some of your favorite scenes to play and was it the Papa Roach scene? <laughs> oh, I mean, that was really, <laughs> we did have margaritas that night. We did, we to did. Get into the, then you're like kind of, Brushing your body yeah, around, just, just moving like, that liquid in your belly, just just feeling very sick. <laughs> I really <laughs> liked um, eating that sandwich, mostly oh, because <laughs> mostly because it really made you laugh. It did. It made I, me laugh, every and I time. liked any time that I could make her laugh. I would like <laughs> to do it like, more. You were like the flavors. <laughs> it is. It was so funny. It was really making me laugh, but like. <laughs> It was, oh God, I'm trying to think of I'm just my favorite scene. All in my mouth. Also, yeah. we have a very sweet scene after the Papa Roach thing where we're laying yeah, in the bed the falling bed. asleep. And that's one of my favorite scenes yeah. actually, because there's a lot of motion behind it. There's a lot of comedy in it too, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. it's um, it's a sweet mixture. It was both. fun to do that. Yeah. 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 So Natalie, tell me about getting the voice just right in the physicality. And Jillian, <laughs> did you break while listening to her? Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> I think there was times when, when I was like, that was too much. Let me try it. You're like, let me take it down one notch. Yeah, I was like, hello. <laughs> <laughs> you know what the voice was? I really don't know. It, I, it, it was just, it, I, I was thinking of somebody who had um, never spoken, but had all the tools to speak. Like I could, uh, at least I'd never spoken English, but theoretically knew how because she had all of Jennifer's memories and, right. and physical abilities, but I, but wouldn't know how to emphasize what, and didn't know how excited to be at certain points, you know? I want you to know that you just said Jennifer's memories. <laughs> you said it's like Jennifer's memories. It's <laughs> so slight. Uh, yeah, I, 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 it's still in me yeah, somewhere. Oh, she's there. I definitely love her there, yeah. <laughs> it's a part of me, I think that internally that is a very excitable alien. Yeah. And so it was not hard to tap into. Oh, you yeah. got that. Yeah. And the smile, getting the smile just right in the eyebrows was great. Yeah. Thank, oh you. God, great. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. Great comedy. And so what was it like working very briefly with Harvey for both of you? Oh, I love Harvey so much. I, I um, directed Harvey in an episode of Room 104. And I knew him from, God, I think from something else. But I, I have always been such a fan of his um, that we got very lucky to have him in this movie. He is delightful like mm -hmm. just a sweetheart of a man and so sharp comedically oh, like yeah. didn't go for any joke that didn't land like it all worked it's all in the film uh he's great I would want to work with him again yes again. over and over yeah so tell me about some of your most memorable days on set or downtime with each other oh wow I mean my my dog taco was on the set with us and I just I loved like he would run around and say hi to all the crew members and hang out oh. with them. and it was that was a little old man and so it was very fun for oh, me God. to have him around yeah and and I just <laughs> it, we shot it in nine days it was really really brief what? oh yeah. my gosh very brief and very busy so it's kind of a whirlwind and I it's was chaotic yeah and I had just 
literally just wrapped plan B. I came directly from wrapping plan B into that. And so I was really tired, <laughs> really tired. I feel um, like you were looking at me a lot. Like, are we saying words? Are we doing yeah, okay? Yeah. And I'm like, you're doing great. Yes. Babe. Like, it's great. Uh, uh, I did look at you. I was like, right, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, yeah, you're, okay. you're good. You're yeah. good. <laughs> But it is, it was, it was a whirlwind. I wouldn't have it any other way, except that maybe you could have had a couple weeks off that just so been that nice. you could yeah. sleep. Yeah. But besides that, it was how it all came together. It was so lovely. It was a really tight crew. We only had about 20 something people, maybe 20. Wow. And, and everyone kind of had like maybe great less. input and, and felt like ownership over the film, which if you leave a film and no one feels ownership, that's kind of when you failed, I feel. Mm -hmm. Like truly, we, you have these amazing, talented people. And then if you don't rely on them, it just kind of, you can tell in the final product, it, you know, it, it can it can feel a little bit like one-sided. And I feel like there were so many good people just chiming in and, and creating this abuse, emotional, beautiful film. Yeah. Yeah. That's beautiful. I love that you had that. So what have the two of you been watching that you've been really into? Ooh, oh my God, I've been question. watching Atlanta and House of Dragons, though I haven't seen the finale yet. I'm waiting for my cousin. I love <laughs> I'm like, don't smile at me. <laughs> I won't say anything. <laughs> the patient. And now How's I'm that? very good, very okay. good. But And I'm watching a friend of the family oh. on Peacock starring Jake Lacey. I'm yes. really into it. Um. Yeah. And Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. The reunion was nuts. <laughs> no, nope. I don't, I don't no. know. <laughs> and so, Natalie, I have to ask you about the morning show. What's your experience been like on that? Um, I just started, so I, I don't have much experience on it yet, but it's been great so far, and I'm really excited to, to be a part of it. Good. Well, thank you both so much for the art that you bring to the you, world. Nice I really appreciate it. Nice to see you. Have a lovely day, yeah, ladies. Okay, bye-bye.